Okay, Shalom Akim, first and foremost, I want to give all praises and all glory unto the true and living power, which is Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Cha, Kadash. Yahweh is the true name of the Heavenly Father. Yahweh Shai is the true name of His only begotten Son, and there's no God beside them. And I want to give double honors unto the apostles and elders of great millstone who rule well, who have taught us this truth through the spirit and power of Yahweh Ba'ashem, Yahweh and honors and citations to the elect document, doing his words in sincerity and in truth. So, hey, man. Trans my last lesson, transference of energy, man. You know? Hey, I'm getting more excited, man. I know Akiman is getting more excited out here. As these other dudes are getting more worried, panicking, bugged out eyes. You know? Dead coat in the headlights. Looking. It ain't looking so good for them, man. All right? So, I'm going to entitle this one, man. E is starting to get physical. Okay? E is starting to get physical. And this is coming out of PA. It says Governor Tom Wolf orders all Pennsylvania businesses that aren't life sustaining to close. Will enforce order. So now it's force. Now you don't got a choice. You might have had some rebellious uh, 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 businesses out there. Look, man, I'm staying open, man. I don't give a shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm staying open. I don't care, bro. This, this coronavirus is a hoax. This coronavirus. It's not even real, man. The government's for look. They don't care. Now it's forced. You don't got a choice no more, right? They dare you to stay open. <laughs> they dare you to stay open, man. Right. So let's get into the news article to get more understanding, man. Right. Uh, uh, Pennsylvania activated the National Guard, so it could not. It could be where it's not police back. It could be National Guard back. You got the National Guard in your business. Like say something, man. This is bullshit. I got my right. And they're gonna they're gonna they're gonna hemp your ass up, throw your ass in jail, man. So I'm gonna tell you his E is getting physical. Alright, because now he's forcing people to do stuff. It ain't no more, you know, this is what you should do, and you know, hey, they got the you know, you should avoid uh, uh, uh ten people gathering together. Soon it's gonna be forced, man. Alright? Soon it's gonna be forced. So it's looking is it's looking very well like you dudes may not have your Passover, man. <laughs> Alright? And that's a scary thing, bro. That's a scary thing, bro. Because here it is, you think that you're going to be saying, well, matter of fact, this is it. This is it. You know, in the state of Pennsylvania, nobody will be having a Passover in Pennsylvania, man. And you know New York is going to be next up. So, this is it, man. Right? Man, we're going to have our Passover. You know, we're going to have our venue. We're going to have our gathering. You know, we don't care what's going on. We know our right. Oh, yeah, now it's forced. Okay? Now it's forced. And it's also to be the famine of the word, man. Because once they're saying, look, man, don't be, you know, in a group of 10, right? All right. Well, hey, we can use wisdom and split up, man. But, you know, so, yeah, yeah, that's, you know, that's different, man. But, um, you know, use wisdom and split them smaller camp. Hey, that's how it was during the time of uh, Yahweh Shai. He sent them out by twos, you know. So, who knows, man? Things is changing, man. Let's get to this article get some scriptures, man. This Governor Tom Wolf has announced. That all but life-sustaining businesses in Pennsylvania must shut down by 8 p.m. Thursday. Period. You done. As the novel coronavirus continues to spread. The governor had previously asked non-essential businesses such as salons. Yo, that's crazy. On my way to the plantation, I saw, I said, what the hell? They still getting their nails done? Because I looked at the salon. I was like, what? They still getting their nails? I thought that was done. Well, yo, I thought that was done, man. They getting their nails done and, you know, the lights was on and the nigga woman coming out. I, I see you. You know what I'm saying? Nah, it's over for that. Now it's forced. I, I wish you would stay open. That's what Esau was saying. I wish you would stay open. Go ahead and test me, man. See, so he's getting physical now. He's turning up the heat. This is non-essential businesses such as salons, gyms, theaters, and entertainment venues to close. There goes your Passover's. It's in Pennsylvania for now. You know, it's going to be in New York if it's, if it's not already is. Under the new order, only businesses deemed critical may continue physical operation. Those include grocery stores, gas stations, farms, and transit systems, according to the Wolf Administration. The order applies to the city of Philadelphia, which previously had been allowed to impose and enforce its own restrictions to protect health and safety of all Pennsylvanians. We need to take more aggressive mitigation actions, was said in a statement. So CE is getting more aggressive. See? 
He's getting more aggressive. This is leading up to the RFID chip. He's going to show his, his horns. He's going to show them draconian laws, man. We're going to have to get even more aggressive. And we're going to have to force you to take the RFID chip. Or you're going to get put to death. That's 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 how aggressive E is going to get. See, so it goes to show you that he's getting more aggressive out here. Okay. Matter of fact, let me look up the word aggressive. It says, an aggressive personal animal has a quality of anger and determination. That makes them ready to attack other people. See? So Esau's Iso, about to start attacking you people. You still think you out here gonna be partying? Okay? Man, this is ruining my spring break, bro. If I get the coronavirus, I get the coronavirus. We still gonna party out here, man. Look, he's getting he's getting ready to attack you stupid ass people, man. He's not playing with you people no more, man. Esau's at the end of his rulership and he's mad as hell, man. He's mad as hell, bro. He's at the end of his rulership, and everybody, you know, that's not of the hopeful leg is gonna have to feel him, man. <laughs> they gonna have to feel him, man. See, so he's getting ready to attack you, people, man. Right. So it says, uh, this virus is an invisible danger that can be present everywhere. We need to act with strength. We use against any other severe threat, and we need to act now before the illness spreads more widely. And yo, the numbers is cranking up, man. Okay, the numbers is cranking up, man. All right, according to Esau, you know, we know he's uh, 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 doing what he's doing. He's making his move. It's lovely. Make your move, man. Because now, guess what? Now the Lord going to start making his move. Oh, where are you turning up? Didn't I tell you touch my touch not my prophets, you know, and, 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 and do them no harm? Didn't I tell you that? So now you think you turn up? Now I'm turning up, man. Okay? And we turning up, man. Through the spirit of power, yeah, how about Shem and our shot? Right? So it says, uh... The order takes effective immediately and will remain in place until further notice, man. Okay. Restaurants and bars earlier in the week were required to stop all dining services. They will still be allowed to offer takeout under the new order the governor's office said. All right. So restaurants and bars can still do their thing, you know, as continue. But soon that's going to stop because that's not no fucking, that's not uh, uh, life sustaining. You don't need to eat out, you know. You don't need to eat a uh, uh, Chick Fil A. You don't need to eat that. That ain't life sustaining. So soon, what to uh, 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 stop the spread? They're gonna have to be shut down, man. Let me get some scriptures, man. Come back, so I can, man. You know, we live in all these scriptures. I, I forgot who posted it. They entitled it. The scriptures is jumping off the page, man. You know. He jumping off the page. We're, we're living this now. All right. So guess what? Like, we got to live the good scriptures too. You know, we're not just going to, the, 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 uh, 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 just to use that brother's um, beautiful example. He said the prophecies are jumping off the page. Not just the bad ones. The good ones about to be jumping off the page too. The prophecies of spiritual powers. The prophecies of how, you know, we're going to be protected. Okay. The prophecies of how we're going to get an increase. You know, those prophecies got to pop off the page too, man. Right, so this is um Isaiah chapter twenty four, verses um uh let's see uh, oh matter of fact I didn't even really this which that's good that's good but I definitely want to get this one right now uh, Ecclesiastes twelve because we live in this bro I was driving down the street some restaurants is closed some is open man we live in this man this is Ecclesiastes twelve and four and the door shall be shut in the streets. When the sign of the grinding is low. Yo, we're living this now. We're living this, man. And the fact that we're living this is the fact that the famine of the word is almost here. We don't have to. Uh, we're not going to have to continue to go out there and speak and tell you that this is coming. Man, pestilence is coming. It's, it's already. Now it's going to begin to speak for itself. And that's Habakkuk, man. Okay. That's Habakkuk. Uh, the second chapter, man. It says, and the door shall be shut in the street. You see? Let's go back to the news article. See? Look at the news article. All Pennsylvania businesses that aren't life sustaining to close. Boom. Boom. Prophecy fulfilled. Being fulfilled. Prophecy being fulfilled. It says when the sound of the grinding is low. The sound of the grinding is low. And my mom's my mom just got laid off, man. I don't know nobody that got the coronavirus, but I know somebody that got laid off, you know, and I started to ask a couple people, you know, yo, you know, anybody 
person that got the coronavirus. Nobody knows nobody that got the coronavirus personally, man. But we know people personally who got laid off, man. Brothers is getting laid off. Family getting, friends getting laid. People getting laid off out here, man. So guess what? They're going to be needful and they're going to be dependent upon Donald Trump and what he's talking about. Look, I'm about to give a check for $1,000. Look, man, even if it does come, eventually it ain't going to come. You know, because this is uh, Isaiah 32 and no, no, no. no. Um, yeah, Isaiah 32 and 9. Rise up, you women that are at ease. And they're still at ease. They're still getting their nails done, hair done, everything done, you know. They're still doing anything. They still got pride. They still think shit is sweet. But um, they're, they're starting to slowly see and they still want to. Uh, 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 turn the, uh, the, the, the eye they still want to turn their eye from what's really going on alright says hear my voice ye careless daughters give ear unto my speech many days and years shall ye be troubled ye careless woman for the vintage shall fail the gathering shall not come see so the vintage is eventually going to fail man and the gathering all your wick, your income tax trumps checks that he wants to give out to you that's all about to fail you know okay so you you you're being dependent upon that, but that's not gonna come to into fruition, man. All right. I wanna finish up this uh, news article, but pretty much that was it. Alright. It says uh Wolf had previously said that his administration would not enforce shutdown orders and that he was relying on self enforcement by businesses, see? So he was depending on you people to do the right thing. It seems like a lot of people still ain't seems, seems like a lot of people still don't know what times we living in, man. A lot of people s still think that shit is sweet, man. That they think that that this is gonna blow over, man. You know, okay, uh, so to speak, because it can. You know, we we we, we do gotta put that uh, a disclaimer out there. You know, but ultimately we know it's gonna come back to this, man. But we believe that this is it. You know, because you got those guys, you got those damn skull. For anyway, man, it says uh that will now change. Enforcement actions will be taken. Ooh. Ooh, ooh. He's getting aggressive. Enforcement actions will now be taken against non-life sustaining businesses that are out of that are that are out of compliance effective Saturday at 12 or 1 a.m. according to the order signed by Wolf. Ooh, you're gonna be hemped up, headlocked, beat up, stop resisting, stop resisting. Ooh, man, it's going down, right? It says, ask which authorities would be carrying out the order. Wolf spokesman Lyson Kirsing sent an email. Law enforcement has a range of uh, uh, potential actions when enforcing the governor's business closure order, such as notifications that the closure order exists, wanting to close citation and mandatory closure, right? Blah, blah, blah. Law enforcement will use appropriate discretion while ensuring that businesses are actively complying with an order. So there is, man, law enforcement. They're going to use law enforcement. All right. 185 cases in PA. Okay. Oh, con, this is good. This is good right here. It says, uh, the governor's office issued a list Thursday of businesses that must close their physical operations. They include car dealers. Lawn and garden stores, specialty specialty food stores, and furniture stores. His order also applies to offices providing legal accounting, architectural tax services. Done. Done. Okay. Done. All these people without jobs now. Done. All right. Done. Um. And what I'm wondering about is um life sustaining. So I guess your auto zones will still be open, even though it didn't list it here. But if the auto zone is done, there will be people really done out here. The auto zones and the uh you know the other one and shit. Okay. It says this is an extremely difficult situation for businesses, said Gene Barr, president of PA Chamber of Business and Industry, it will cause real economic harm. It already has, but the governor had to make the tough choice. See, so the collapse is coming. Economic collapse is coming. Oh, the financials is going to be messed up. And what's going to be a solution? The RFID chip, the one-stop shop. 
has your vaccine, it has your new bank information, it has your new identity, it has your new uh, uh, rations tracker to make sure you're not buying too much. It's the one-stop shop, but that's just the mark of the beast, okay? Right? This is more good stuff. It says, there has been at least some initial confusion about the new directive, blah, 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 that's blah, 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 shit. But this next one, some of my hotels are housing doctors who are here to help coronavirus patients, said Gross, adding that hotels were worried they would have to throw people out on the street, including medical staff. He said the governor's office has since said that it will clarify hotels can remain open and cause total panic. Right, so these hotels are still open, but soon they're going to be shut down, man. All right, so this is a lot, man. You know? Skimming through it, so calm, man. All right, so they have so if you ain't if you ain't a life sus, sus, uh, a sustaining business, and you still think it should have sweet, your ass gonna be hemp the fuck up, man. All right? Esau's getting more aggressive out here, you know. So it's 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 um um it, it's pretty much getting worse and worse out here, you know. The 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 cases are are climbing fast. Esau is getting more aggressive. The, the economy is hanging on by a thread. It's looking like this may be it, Aki. All right. So, the one, you know, just wanted to run through that. You know, signs of the time, measuring the signs of the times. You know, Lobo Lucas Edifying Show.